In this tutorial, I'm going to be giving you more than five options and how to get creative to make your own patterns for this song. I hope you enjoyed my little cover of a cover of ILY, I Love You Baby. This is a great song to learn for some new chords, if you've been following my beginner series, because it uses only four chords, but there are some more intermediate chords. So we have E minor, which is still really a beginner's chord, but it's one of those ones that people have a little trouble with. Make sure you have your first finger on the second fret of your string closest to your toes, second finger on the third fret of the E string, second closest to your toes, and third finger on the fourth fret of our C string, second closest to our nose. From there, we move up to A. Focus on your peace sign fingers because they keep this shape and they just go straight up into the A position. First finger on C string on the first fret and second finger on the second fret of our G string. From there, we play D. Focus on this second finger moving down a fret and your other two fingers going either side. Then we have B minor. For that, what we want is a bar where your first finger bars the entire second fret. So you make sure that you have your thumb placed on the back of your neck to give a bit of pressure to get that chord and make sure that you're hugging your ukulele into yourself to counterbalance that. From there, you can put your third finger on the fourth fret of your G string. If this is too hard, there is an easier option. You can, from D, simply move all of those three fingers down a string and just play the bottom three frets. It's a little hard to only play the bottom three, but in one point of the song, I just played the bottom three strings. So that's your easier option. Once you can play the chords, there's a few different options. You could start with just playing single strums. I love you, baby, and if it's quite all right, I need you, baby, to warm these lonely nights. Or you could do two strums, one and two and three and four. So you'll notice it's a down and an up, and the counting really helps here. One and two and three and four and one two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and I love you baby and you'll hear how baby it's that rhythm I love you baby and if it's quite all right I need you baby to warm these lonely nights and pay attention to the words I say on which strums, that helps some people. At one point I build up that strumming a little bit and it actually chops and changes a fair bit through the song and I do this to encourage you to be a bit creative. You don't have to follow everything that YouTubers say to do because we're most of the time making up our own thing anyway. You can follow my strumming series which I'll link above here and that will teach you how to do this. I love you baby That was down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, down. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. So there are strumming options. Then there's a few picking options as well. You'll notice that at the start of the song, I began with the picking pattern. It sounds like this. Play this picking pattern don't worry about the chords yet but i'll hold an e minor just to show as an example but every chord plays the same pattern i play the two outside strings and then moving from my toes to my nose i play the middle two strings so i play out middle out one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a now this is a little bit more of a complicated counting pattern and I'm going to get to that to my strumming series soon so if you haven't already don't forget to click subscribe so you can be updated when I teach this pretty soon. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one and that just changes each time you play a different chord. Again, 
I made up this pattern though, so you can make up whatever pattern you want. And I do have a series on finger picking patterns and how to make your own, which could help you out if you want to get creative. The easier finger picking version that I did, again, take away the top string and you can just play. The pattern is our C string, then our E and A string, and then back to our C string. One and two and three and four and. You'll see I was still placing my fingers on the G string. That's just because if you can play the chords, do play the chords, but it just makes it easier if you're not quite ready to bar yet. I love you, baby, and if it's quite all right, I need you, baby, to warm these lonely nights. I love you, baby, trust me when I say. I've used a loop pedal so that I could demonstrate different things all at once. I'm using the Boss RC300. I'll put a link to the latest model below. And you can even do this using an acapella app. It can be a bit of fun too.